Hello everyone, I hope you're well. This is Coins Kid. Just going to allow me to XRP once again. Thank you for support, okay? Big up the Coins Kid crew. So we've got three lovely little indicators here that I like to use. Uh, one is the 20 week EMA, which is the big thick yellow line. One is the whole suite by Silico, which is the band basically, the ribbon. And then equally the other one is the 21 EMA zones by TR. Now I've gone through these with you before. Uh, the best way to look at them, in my opinion, is to take the candles out. So you can do that by going up there and then just clicking the eye icon. So if you take them out, you can clearly see what's going on here for XRP. So the, the whole suite indicator here is doing something, in my opinion, that's technically quite bullish that can't be ignored. Okay, so you can clearly see since we flipped green way back there in September, we've come back to the top end of the ribbon twice. Okay, uh, three times actually. We came back to it just there in that correction way back in May, and we bounced again. So you know, if we do come back, then I will be looking for support on the 20 week year May, which is currently where we find support, you know, and the top of this ribbon again. So you know, one thing that would be quite bearish and negative in the short term for XRP is losing this okay and going red and flipping red on the ribbon basically but we're not doing that at the moment so we have to respect the data and what we're doing by holding this ribbon it's creeping us up creeping us up and it's forcing us this original resistance where we retraced to way back there in October of 2022 so we've had sort of two resistance retests on that resistance right now so effectively if we can continue to hold this support and this continues to creep up creep up this will force XLP to break out basically you know so again we'll keep an eye on the charts a weekly time frame if this flips red then that's quite a negative statement and we're not necessarily going to get the breakout anytime soon we'll potentially come back and make a high low and then you know eventually break out eventually possibly who knows but we have to respect the data and so far so good we're coming up we're making a series of high lows we're into the same resistance so basically compression isn't it and this is something i was looking at from way back there i think everyone was saying we're going to do something like that but i said over a long period of time if we can create a reversal of this big sort of toppy pattern which is three levels of support you know the, the ribbon is resistance and dropping again then if we can create reserve reversal over a long period of time then it's creating more probability of the fact that this is your bottom and right now you're going to start to come up and break okay and retrace to all these points of contact up here these resistance levels but there's one thing that's going on here in the charts that's technically quite bullish for up here and no one's looking at it so again not hopium not emotion you know it's just purely data which is what i relay to you on a daily basis and it's entirely up to you what you do with that information okay so technically at the moment we keep falling back to the ribbon of support which is really nice and like i said to you at this point here i think xrp is in a correction and like i'm saying to you at this point here i do actually think xrp is in a correction looking for continuation okay so you know these indicators are sort of showing us that at the moment okay not bullshit not opium data so what happened here uh, way back in 2020 uh, october after this massive sort of correction from August coming back down consolidation above the, the the yellow zone which is the 20 week EMA and equally the TR zones okay and obviously the whole suite indicator as well remaining green we fell back to its support pretty much like we're doing right now and we held it but one thing that the, the whole suite indicator here the ribbon did which was really really bullish and a precursor to a massive massive move like that was break the 20 week EMA as support as a resistance sorry I do apologize it smashed through it as resistance that was a very 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 powerful signal that XRP did way back there in October because it was a warning shot that XRP was about to do this okay uh, just like this warning shot was just there when XRP the ribbon lost the support of the 20 way back there in February 2022 once it pierced it it was a massive warning shot to this so we need to keep an eye on this going forward okay because this right now is breaking the 20 week EMA the ribbon is busting through it pretty much like it did way back there in 2020 so it could be a warning shot right now you know regardless of the correction and the pullback that XRP is going through it's a buy because basically we could be gearing up for a massive massive move and the warning shot for that particular massive move is the fact that the ribbon is breaking the 20 week EMA it really is that simple so again data not emotion okay so I hope you enjoyed that swift little update I'll be back tomorrow with another update on Bitcoin but uh, XRP sorry but so far so good let's respect the data not emotion okay good luck everybody back soon take care bye bye